customers want something that maybe, you know, they've had tres leches, now they want to try something new. So we have entered into different flavors. We have the pecan, which is really, really popular. It's really, really um, catching on. People, it's different. It, it has the pecan flavor to it. It's got the pecans inside the batter. Now we've tried the piña colada, which has pineapple and coconut in the batter also. And it has that fruity flavor. So, I mean, we keep going. We just try to keep coming up with new recipes just to keep our customers interested and not, you know, oh, tres leches again. This is a different tres leches. When they have like special requests of fillings, we do fruit fillings, we do like mousse fillings. We have a cajeta filling, which is dulce de leche, the caramel filling. That's also very popular, they like that. They do try new flavors, they do, we um, suggest when it's, they don't want the same tres leches, we suggest new flavors. We have non tres leches too. We do have chocolate, mousse, uh, vanilla, marble, uh, carrot cake, we do do those flavors, but tres leches is still the favorite. So if they, well maybe they want a cake that's half and half, we also do that. We will do your cake, half tres leches, half chocolate, and then you can provide, you know, flavors for someone who doesn't want tres leches. You have to venture into um, trying something different, a new recipe, uh, maybe a different filling, a new ingredient. It, if it doesn't work, you have nothing to lose, but if it works, you hit the jackpot.